I'd like to make another point about this flat earth debate thing that's out there. Um, I let the thing go for far too long. I should have come out against it a lot earlier because it's hurt a lot of people, led a, a lot of people astray. And now a lot of people are fully convinced um, because the, the deception has gotten so bad. Um, but, you know, I just, I need to make a point here. Uh, I was raised um, in church buildings and going to churches and all that stuff. And I was um, dedicated as a little baby, you know, up in front of the church building. And even the pastor's wife came to the hospital where I was born and prayed over me there. And, you know, uh, I've been around Christians all my life. And growing up, I heard the debates about Calvinism versus Arminianism. I heard about, you know, eternal security. Can you lose your salvation? You know, uh, all that stuff that Christians argue over, you know. Um, baptismal regeneration, baptism by immersion, baptism by sprinkling, uh, you know, stuff about the Catholics and whatever, you know. And um, that entire time, I don't remember anybody ever arguing about the shape of the earth. Ever. Uh, and I remember the first time I heard about it, I think it was 2016, and, uh, get, hey, sorry, my dog was trying to get into something there. First time I heard about it was 2016, and, uh, somebody sent me a link to this New Age video about the Earth being flat, and I thought, okay, uh, huh? <laughs> And, you know, at the time, I mean, this guy in the video, he's got long hair, and another guy had these big log things through his ears, and they're talking about, man, yeah, the earth is flat, yeah, man. And I just thought, why would a Bible believer fall for this? This is ridiculous, you know. And um, and then I, I just kind of, uh, whatever, and then I started hearing some of the different people that were watching the ministry, and or, you know, watching videos from the ministry here, and and they started coming out and saying, you know, hey, what do you think about this flat earth thing and, and uh, all this other stuff? And, and I just thought, oh, really? And um, as time went by, I started to see the division coming in. And the, the whole thing of, you know, I'd preach about the catching up of the body of Christ. Oh, you know, it relates to the flat earth. I'd preach about eternal security. Oh, it relates to the flat earth. I teach everything I teach about. Somebody's writing about flat earth and they get into arguments with people. Somebody would say, no, the earth isn't flat. And, oh, and they, they would just attack the person. And I finally had to make a video just saying, stop talking about this flat earth stuff in the comments. Every video does not relate to the flat earth. That you're acting very cultic. Stop it. You know, so I didn't bring the contention. You know, I've waited for years to make videos coming out and saying, I'm not flat earth. I don't believe in the flat earth. You know, but this contention that's been there, um, I've seen it for years. I've experienced it. That's a, one of the big reasons why I have to reject the whole movement. It's not of God. Uh, it's kind of like the Mandela effect and some of these other things that have come out, you know, just recently here. Um, all of a sudden, it's this major issue and we have to talk about it and all this. Uh, no, it's not a major issue. You know, and it, it, even if it was true. I'll be real gracious here. Um, it doesn't mean anything to me what the shape of the earth is. Oh, look, this is actually all just a flat plane out here and whatever else and things. And uh, Wow, it's so important. Uh, no, actually, uh, watching the economy crash is very important to me. Um, seeing what are the Catholics doing out there? What's the Catholic Church doing? I know that they'll come to power eventually in the end times. What can I do to hinder that? Um, seeing different religious cults and systems and things like that that's the kind of stuff that's important to me you know uh the this whole perversion thing going crazy and they're trying to take away guns and saying we need gun control and i mean there's things that are direct threats to my life and the earth being a sphere or being flat or whatever else it does not affect my immediate life it doesn't and i see this thing i saw a video yesterday about some flat earth conference in denver colorado or something i think and there was an atheist an atheistic guy there and and uh he's a flat earther and i'm thinking okay <laughs> doesn't believe in the bible or whatever but there there's this motto that they had there at the thing and it said um uh the the bible says flat earth uh no it does not and that's just a very quick thing that you can look and, and just type in flat earth in a search thing for the King James Bible. 
the King James Bible does not say flat earth. So to say the Bible says flat earth, uh, we say, well, it just, it means the Bible teaches flat earth. No, when you're saying the Bible says flat earth, you say, Brian said such and such. You have to quote me directly or else you're a liar. The Bible says flat earth. It has to say flat earth or else you're a liar. So there's so many lies and deception and so many very wicked people in this movement. It's not of God. It can't be of God. It, it fails so many tests in scripture. You know, and I've seen people too in the comments and they say, they say, well, you know, the, the real people bring in division are the globe earthers. The globe earthers are the ones that make problems. Uh, you know what? All the years I've been in ministry, been on YouTube since 2008. I was in ministry preaching in church buildings before then. All the years, I never had one globe earther come up to me and say, you need to clarify your stand on the globe earth, brother. You need to start preaching more about the globe earth. I never had one. Never one. Flat earthers uh, on YouTube since 2016 when I first started to see this heresy come up. Oh, oh, just all the time. They're always making problems. So, see over there, the, I don't know if you can see that back there. Uh, sun's coming up, but, uh, so, I just wanted to say that real quickly about this whole thing, this whole movement. Um, just another thing there, I never heard about it till recently, which tells me it's another PSYOP, another heresy. So, um, be coming out with a few more things about this whole deal, and then I'll be done and moving on to other more important issues. That's going to be it. Thank you for watching.